welcome back and welcome if you are new today's video i am going to be doing some aid decorating it is at that time of the year as ramadan comes to an end we're going to be closing down and bringing you guys some aid decorating ideas as well and i'm hoping to do the uh, aid decorating like we're going to do the living room i don't know if i'll come around to the kitchen but i'm going to try and i want to do the dining area as well and then the entryway so let's go ahead and start some clean slate oh yeah Another thing I want to say is, I'm loving this outfit. Let me just show you all. It's like a long shirt. I'm just wearing a trousers underneath, but like, can you believe it? I got like a lot of these shirts, like a, a dress shirt. That's what they're called. And they come in different styles. Believe it or not, I got it from Temu. Yeah, they stepped up their game. I probably, one of these days in one of my videos if you guys want to see it let me know i can throw in some modesty fashion for y'all you know me i'm a modest person i'm always covered up but like if you want to see shein versus temu because i actually legitimately ordered some things from shein and some things from timu just to compare they look almost the same you know i honestly believe they're twin brothers just different names basically all right Let's do some decorating. So I already like cleared everything. Like I already gave it a, like I cleaned the couch. I kind of wiped down everything and I took down a lot of things that I knew I'm not gonna use it for this video. I also brought that table here and I took the ladder here that I always have in the dining. I'll show you guys when we're doing the dining. But yes, so we're gonna start clean slate. At one point, after I had removed the everything, I was like, oh my goodness, the whole space looks so nice, just so spacious and minimalist. I'm like, you know what? Minimalist does not look that bad at all. And then I was like, uh, nah, because I don't really like to put anything on the walls. So therefore, I'm very maximalist on like the ground area, but very minimalist on the upper and so i was like nah everything's gonna look so cold and I, I like to keep it nice and warmth and cozy and just feel like it's lived in so although i cleaned all the chairs and kind of wiped it down with a cloth i wanted to quickly use the swiffer and just swift down any dust and i'm starting up here i'm just adding the eight mabotic sign and this sign i got it from amazon a while back maybe like three years ago and the rest of the decor is honestly it's just everything that has been around the living room just sometimes i rearrange everything and just give it in a like a new home and things look better like all this stuff i used it for the ramadan decorating as well but i just rearranged it and right here in this corner i used to have the ladder which you'll see it later i add that in the dining room uh, between the two cabinets and yes we will get into the dining room decorating you know honestly uh when i was doing this video my intention was just the living room my intention was actually just to do eat decorating and then after getting one thing into another i was like oh i was getting into that summer vibe and summer mood so i was like i'm gonna start doing a little bit of early summer decorating as well so I have this basket that I got actually from Amazon and these faux stem roses they are all from HomeSense each year I like to collect to one and so all I did was just add like a faux rosemary stems on each side that I got from Michaels just to fill that basket I will show you guys everything how it looks at the end of the video once I'm done decorating the entire main floor and so on the ledge here i'm also adding this vase that i got from home since i've had it for i think two years maybe i don't know if i got it early last year or if i got it in 2022 at some point and all those stems that i added i got them all from between home since and michael's and i've just had them for over like over the last couple of years these rose stems i have them in pink in yellow in white and then this year i bought them in that dark purple which you'll see it in my entryway credenza i love them so much they're not cheap either like per three stems and they're very long i think they're 14.99 so i you i usually get them two 
two sets each year so I, i've been collecting them and that little vase that i just put there i thrifted i will have a video coming soon where it's thrift shop with me and style um yeah so that vase i was thrifted and then i added this other pillow the, the big pillows were all the same what i've already had i love them and it also kind of goes with the vibe and the colors that i chose for this decorating which is going to be dark purple i know look at that plum what do we call this vibrant purple comment down below what we should call this color i think i will just call it plum i'll just stick with plum that morning i also tried that table between the two chairs but it was a little bit too tall so i just went ahead and put back the original table that i always have it's a little bit shorter which is much better and then on the coffee table just to have three things to have like that what do they say to style it in three which makes a triangle so i added that potpourri bowl and this tic-tac-toe game i'm gonna lit up a candle and then in bet between the two chairs here i'm just gonna add this faux olive stem that i got from temu and let me share a little bit haul from temu as well which we are going to go to the dining next so here are a couple of things also that i got from temu these were some essential oils this is just a little brush to clean like the uh, vents in the car uh, i got some lights as well uh, i got a table runner it's just the eight stuff that just says eight mubarak oops things are flying and i'm going to be using this right now and then i got some napkin ring i kind of quickly showed you guys on the last video and then i got these these are just little individual decors they do light up and you can just lay them around i'll see how i'm going to use them i got some gift bags as well and just a little eat decor um just little signs kind of like a, a faux wood uh to hang my original idea was uh, to make like a little tree and then hang all this as an ornament but we'll see what i can do with it and then these are just the treat boxes that i got that i'm gonna use it um not today because it's still a couple of days from eight and so i just wanted to get this video for you guys but these are the stuff that i'll use on eight but when i do use it after eight on the next following video i'll share with you guys what i got for gifts and then this is just a little toothpick uh stick stuff for just desserts and they just say eat mubarak on it and then i also got this other sign here that just says eat and i'm going to replace it with this one here that I got like earlier in Ramadan, so that will be perfect. It's just gonna be like that. So I'm just gonna take that down and replace it with this one. It's just so pretty and it has a little string already. I love that one too, cause it's got the, uh, the bow and I got both of them from Temu as well. So that's all I got. And then these were stuff that I got from Amazon, which I shared already in a spring haul that I did but I will be using them. So right now we're gonna move over to the dining room. So I brought the, uh, the ladder over here. And then I just added this sign here. This sign was, uh, I think it was on top of the pantry a while ago. And then I bought this little eat sign from Temu. I thought it had like a little stand that you put it on, but no. And then I added this tiny little vase and just carrying on that little lavender purple throughout the whole house. And it looks like my peacock clock here really goes very well with it. We do need to change the time because right now it's like 2.30, not almost 11. And I'll show you the inside, um, looks like this, nothing much changed. I don't like to change too much around in these cabinets because I just love, whenever I set it up, I love the way it is. And I always set it up so that I can keep it for a very long time. I recently already changed all of the frames, kind of did it very moody vibe. And this cabinet's very dark, it's already moody. And today I just added this little pineapple jar just to kind of like bring the summer, you know, vibe. And then I have that lily here. It's a full of flowers. So.
and over here here I have that sign just the prayer sign this lavender believe it or not I put it in last summer from the garden and it's still looking beautiful it's dry I just kept it here and then I have that sign over there or that print and yeah nothing much changed here I just kept it the same kind of way And now we're gonna decorate this table. And this table runner that says in Mubarak, I think it was like $2, it was from Temu. And I brought out my very heavy pod. I've had it for a couple of years. And then I'm just gonna put on the sides, two candles. And then I love this porcelain uphole and pear. You can use them honestly all seasonal. I love using it fall or spring. And then I got these placemats. They do come in a set of six. I think I did share with you guys in my spring haul. And I'm gonna add these chargers. I've had these chargers for like 15 years. I love them so much. So was this plate. I've had this plate since I had my oldest son. And then I'm just using a salad plate. We actually use them for iftar and soup bowls. I wanted to use it where, uh, like decorated where it's more functional as well, but we're also going to glam it up. And I just wanna add like useful uh, the glasses that we're gonna use to drink with. So I'm adding this four glasses here. Um, I think that's all I have left of this four glasses. They used to be like eight. And then the napkins, I'm going to add this linen napkins. I love them so much. They have this beautiful like scallop looking ruffles. I've had them for like two years. I think I got it when I officially got my dining set two years ago, like two springs ago. And I'm also using this napkin rings from Temu. They did come in a set of six, but I only need four. And they're so perfect because the color just kind of goes with the chair and the wood of the table. I actually took the cover out too from my wood table because I always have this cover, like clear cover, and but I took it out. It was so like out of shape. I got these utensils from Temu. I love the shape of them. They look so beautiful. They have that like skeleton look, like a like that horror beautiful look i just love that skeleton look it looks so classic but we'll see how long you know the quality looks absolutely fine right now but they were very light not very heavy you know what i mean and so i'm just gonna set it up the gold utensils because i wanted to have that turquoise and but it still has like a lavender inside right like a little bit you could see it a little bit of blue so I want to have that gold and white and well, while I still maintain color, but I still want to have some neutrals as well. So these faux stems, this dark purple ones, I got them from Amazon along with those pink ones. I shared all this with you guys back in February. I'm just going to fill this pot here until it's like nice and fluffy. The way I'm doing it, I'm just letting them stand because I don't want them to float over the table since... We are going to use the table to eat uh, during iftar, but it still looks very nice leaving them up facing up. I'll show you guys up close shots once I am done all of it. Once I'm done with the dining room, we are more going over to the entryway. Uh, I wanted to quickly go ahead and hang this wreath now that it's officially spring. You guys, we had a winter again, okay? Right after I installed that gazebo, we had winter again. It's crazy. But yeah, it's it's like already melted, so it's fine, alhamdulillah. I'm so grateful. I hope you all have a wonderful Eid as well, man. Whatever your plan is, let me know if you guys do something fun. Here, we usually just do the usual thing. We hang out with family. We do big breakfast. We meet up somewhere. And we all hang out until we're all exhausted. And we come home and we go to sleep. But yeah. Uh, so I'm going to add this light strings. I've had this light string from Amazon for a couple of years. This credenza, it's so big. This light is so big too, so it just worked out so perfect. But I will be redecorating my entryway um, because I have a, this big antique mirror or vintage that I've had since like my first home that I bought. 
Um, it's, it has a story to it. It's in my furnace room. I haven't used it since I moved to this house. It's so heavy, honestly. But I'll share with you guys plus the story behind it. But right now, I'll let you all enjoy the rest of this video. I'm going to continue decorating. I still need to add some curtains. I hope you guys are getting some inspiration. And if you aren't new to my channel or if you have not subscribed, I please will ask you to all to subscribe. It's free. It supports my channel. And if you all enjoyed today's video as well, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. But right now, I'll, let, I'll stop talking and let you all enjoy the rest of this video with a little bit of music and I'll come back to it. Just hope that we're still okay You always pick me up and let me down We're spinning around, losing our minds Damned if we do, damned if we don't Damned if we give in what we want And I always pick you up and let you down We're spinning around, losing our minds Damned if we do I had some leftover of the curtain uh, like at uh, the hooks um, and I thought I had enough but then I came to when I started counting I was like six short so I would need to order more but for the time being I just hang the purple just straight in the rod which is fine honestly but I mean it serves the purpose right but it looks so beautiful and right now I just took that Ramadan sign out here and just switched it to Aid Mobotic, uh, Aid Mobotic and then these little cute twinkle lights I don't know what they are they are all different shapes they're so beautiful especially at night uh, I wish I did like a I will try to do like a nighttime clip for you guys uh, on the next video but they're so pretty at nighttime when they're just lighting up and I kind of scattered them around the house I didn't know what to do with them at first but then at, at the end I figured out, I was like okay I'll just scatter them around and you'll see how it turned out
Eid Mubarak, my friends. Thank you so much for taking time out of your day. And I hope to see you on the next one. Bye.